do subscribe to ikeda channel and press bell icon to get updates about latest engineering hsc and iit je main and advanced videos hello students today we are studying chapter excretion and osmoregulation in that we are studying topic osmoregulators now the definition of osmoregulation is that maintaining salt and water in your body so what are osmoregulators let's study and find out about them today Osmoregulation could be said as a process that tries to maintain the salt and water balance in your body, which is very very crucial. So, process that regulates salt and water balance is termed as osmoregulation. Now, animals whose internal osmolarity, that is the presence of salt and water, remains constant and doesn't change it according to the surrounding or according to the atmosphere, are termed as osmoregulators. now all vertebrates or i could simply say human beings is an example those who try and maintain their osmolarity levels constant even if you've been to any country that's very very hot for example even if the temperature outside is 45 degree celsius still your body internal balance of salt and water would be tried and maintained osmo regulators now the process that helps to keep in check or in balance or regulate the concentration of salts like sodium potassium and water in your body is termed as osmo regulation now dehydration could be said as the deficiency or the presence of water in our body and osmo regulation is just trying to maintain that water as salt concentration in your body the animals whose internal osmolarity remains constant and doesn't changes according to the situation medium for example if weather change or your external atmosphere change that doesn't impacts their osmolarity those are termed as osmoregulators and most of the vertebrates if we talk about are osmoregulators an example of this could be human being osmoregulation and excretion are very closely associated or they are 
related to maintain homeostasis or internal environment constant that is the proportion of salt and water has to be very constant now these processes are undertaken by the same set of organs that are responsible during the process of excretion and also your kidneys they play a very crucial part during the process of osmoregulation in vertebrates so we could simply say that excretion as well as osmoregulation are very coordinatedly linked now the amount of matter or nitrogenous waste that's excreted from your body the process during that and before that osmoregulation or you can say adda filtration that's done by your kidneys or removal of undigested waste done by your small intestine large intestine the nephrons of your kidney has a close association with osmoregulation or the reabsorption process to reabsorb or take in back the salts from your body so students in this part of the chapter we did study what were osmoregulators and how do they function and how they are associated in close contact with your kidney and your excretion process i hope you all are very clear about this concept thank you